Hey everyone, Edward here at Windows Report and in this video I will show you what to do if Windows 11 is stuck on tablet mode. Before we dive in into any solutions, just make sure of the following things. You can check if the keyboard is attached to the tablet. So if you have a tablet or a device like the Surface device, make sure that the tablet mode is enabled when you disconnect the keyboard from the system. So therefore to disable it, you simply need to reconnect the keyboard and make sure that the connections are in order. You can also rotate the screen. Basically, another way to enable the tablet mode is to flip the screen all the way to the back. Now go back to desktop mode and simply rotate the screen back to the initial position. That means your system should automatically revert to desktop mode as soon as the screen is rotated. Now let's dive into the solutions. The first solution that you should take in consideration is to restart Windows 11. As simple as it may sound, this will solve a lot of problems usually. So click the Windows button, then select the power icon and select the restart option. Now Windows will restart and then you can check if the problem still persists. Another useful solution is to update Windows 11. To do this, press the Windows button and then simply type update and select the check for updates option from the search results. In here you can see a blue check for updates button, so just click it and then Windows will try and find the best possible updates for your PC. Another useful solution is to run an SFC scan. To do this, press the Windows button, then simply type CMD and run command prompt as an administrator. In here, type the following command and press enter after the command. You will have to wait a bit because the SFC scan usually takes some time, but after the scan is complete, simply restart the computer and check if the Windows 11 is still stuck on tablet mode. And lastly, another great solution is to perform a system restore. To do this, press the Windows button and simply type RSTRUI and then select it as a run command from the search results. In here, make sure to go with choose a different restore point and then click on next. Now simply select the earliest point in time before the problem occurred and then click on next and lastly press on finish to start the restoration process. And that's it, plenty of options to consider in the long run. As usual, for more information and details you can check the article in the description below. And if you enjoyed this video just make sure to like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.